morning, everybody. Say hi. Say hi. She don't want to say hi. <laughs> Chris is inside getting ready. Uh, we are just north of Bakersfield, California, with 266 miles to go to our delivery and six hours and 35 minutes to get there. Uh, from there, hoping to go to Salinas, pick up a load, and haul butt for Florida with a delay on the way. Uh, Chris needs to see the dock. I need to get a new rear wheel for my bicycle. Still has me upset. Mm. All went reasonably well last night. Uh, clear skies all the way. I uh, had to scrub the heck out of the windshield again when I stopped for fuel. But it's not bad right now. If you watched yesterday's video... You'll see some of the issues with the bugs on the windshield kind of thing. Uh, we need a new windshield. This one's getting pitted. But 243,790 miles. What we got on here now. Whew. We drive a lot. <laughs> and you really think about it. We drive a lot. Boy, but it looks like it's going to be a beautiful day. Had a wonderful, beautifully clear night. And we'll see how long it takes to get to just the other side of Sacramento from here. Uh, go up to Sacramento, we're going to take the south loop around the east side, and then we got to go east just a hair to get to where we're going. So I'm going to see if Chris is almost ready yet and see what we can grab for breakfast. I know I need to get some milk. So I might just have a bowl of cereal. I might eat some more of the beans that I made that I told you about last night. Don't know yet, but I am going to get some milk. <coughs> okay, we are unloaded. Uh, excuse me for coughing there. We are unloaded. We don't have a pre-plan. They sent us one that was not doable. Then they sent us another one. We're like, okay, we'll take it, even though we have to go 150 miles out of route because Chris needs to see the doctor. And then they took it away from us. So we do not have a pre-plan. Now, last time we were at this we delivered here, we ended up going to the truck stop, taking a rest, uh, reset right here in town. So, uh, right now we're going to head up to the bicycle shop, six and a half miles away. I just got off the phone with them. And they're waiting on us. They're ready to replace the rim. Good. Now i got to figure out how I'm going to hang the darn thing up. So, uh, so that we got that done. So as soon as Chris closes the doors, which he's just about done doing, we're hauling butt up there. Oh my God, it's freaking hot. Lordy, it's 102 here. And we're sitting on black, black asphalt. Lordy, we're heading to the truck stop. Uh, going to the 49er. 49er! Yeah, as Chris says, 40 whiner. I got the rim replaced on the bike. I also needed the tube, a rim guard, which is that little rubber thing that goes uh, and covers the spoke rivets. In four and three quarter miles, and a tire. take exit on right. To our 80 West. Lordy, I am um, wiped out. I started putting the parts on the bike. 
the water bottle that I got will not work on Chris's bike. So I gotta get a different one for her. Uh, I mean, the bottle's good, it's just the holder won't mount, so I'm just gonna get a holder. Thank you. Now I'm going to get the rest of this stuff mounted, but it is just too hot today. It cost me $100 for the rim and everything. Which doesn't make me entirely happy. And I moved the rack so nothing's rubbing. I took some adjusting and fiddling and doing and hanging Chris's bike a little different. But hopefully we'll be good to go. Now, they gave us two, two different loads. Knowing that we need an uh, on-route reset, the first one was totally undoable. The second one was doable, but we'd have had to go out a route, which I was willing to do. And then they took that load from us, so we do not have a load assigned at all. Hopefully they'll find one first thing in the morning. Because Chris needs to see the MD. I'm rambling, I'm hot, I'm tired, I'm brain dead, so I'm going to hang up. Well, we made it to the truck stop. Yay. Found a parking space. Yay. Now we're going to go in and take a much needed shower. Yay. I don't care how long the line is. We didn't get a shower on the way up here because uh, we had to push too hard, so. Uh, can't wait. <laughs> uh, I feel so much better. Got my shower. Chris is still in there, of course. She should be done shortly. And we may go across the street to the Black Bear Diner and have dinner. Don't know for sure yet. It's almost 11 o'clock our time. But we're going to get to sleep late because we don't have a load yet. And by the time they find a load here, she'll have slept late enough to make up for it and everything. So we might go eat. I don't know. Uh, I'm not going to take the quad up tonight, I don't think. We're not that close to downtown Sacramento to get a good view of Sacramento. Uh, there's a mall a little over a mile away. I mean, it'll show up, but... Nighttime flying out here is not going to be that good. The sun's just not going down. I still got yesterday's video to edit up. I didn't do that this morning. And some other things going on, so... I don't know what we're going to do. Uh, I might just go inside here and eat. She might just lay down. I'll grab something to snack on or I'll eat more beans. We still got beans left. So... Gonna have to figure it out when she gets out. <laughs> 